Hey everybody, I'm Lance Koike. Today we are going to discuss the close grip chin up. And the reason we're doing that is because today is actually, the, the day that this comes out is actually my birthday. And this exercise is awesome for getting big arms. And that sounds like the most fun video to put out on my birthday. <laughs> Uh, so uh, the the pulling the dis, uh, like execution of the movement is exactly the same as the pull up and as the chin up. I'm just scooting my hands in a little bit more here. So I don't want to run through actually doing a pull up if you or chin up. If you've done a chin up, it's the same thing. You just move your hands in a little bit. What you have to consider is I'm stealing some of my motion when I bring my hands in like that, right? So I, I pinch my sides in. Uh, or I pinch my elbows into my sides a little bit more and it steals some of the motion that I have available because now when I get to my pull up, I am squeezing into my torso. Um, so you have to consider that. I, I wouldn't take the blanket internet information that you might get that says if you don't do a full range of motion, you're not doing this effectively. I don't think that rule really applies here. I think the purpose of the exercise should it should be very clearly stated. If you want to get really strong at your close grip pull up or close grip chin up, then yeah, sure, you can do that. Um, and, and maybe you start to stress the amount of weight that you maybe hang from your waist or getting away from maybe some sorts of assistance if you have an assistance machine or maybe you're using a band to help pull you up and unweight your body. Uh, but generally, if I'm using a close grip chin up, I'm doing it because I want to get big. Uh, so, you know, the things that make me big are a caloric surplus, a protein surplus, diet and diet, and then training hard, right? I don't have to be in any particular rep range. I don't have to use particular weights. I just need to make sure that I'm pushing myself. I'm pushing into levels of fatigue that I'm not normally at, and I am trying to eventually uh, progress myself in the the amounts of weights and challenge overall challenge that I present upon my body. So as long as you're getting those muscles to really fatigue and as long as you're pushing yourself a little bit harder than you were last time you did this, I think you're probably getting what you need to get out of the close grip chin up. So please <laughs> take this advice. Go find anything that you can hang from. Maybe not just a door frame, though I have been known to do it. Uh, I don't want you to ruin anything, but find a pull-up bar and knock out as many of those as you can for me because it's my birthday. 